first sip. Morning, guys. We just went to Starbucks. This drink is so fucking good. The caramel does it for me. It's a empty iced white mocha with vanilla sweet cream cold foam and extra caramel drizzle. Mm. They didn't make the actual drink as sweet. I just realized that was on. I'm struggling. I'm just not doing well right now. <laughs> Pimple patches on my fucking face right now. And I also got a baking gouda with no bacon. And I'm hungry. Sorry, there's like too many noises going on. We are going to Ikea right now. I'm excited because it's a new Ikea than what we are used to. I've never been to this Ikea because we moved like kind of, it's not even that far away that we moved, but there's another Ikea over here. So we're going to a new Ikea. And I tried out like, new hair stuff last night after the shower and I it kind of I think I put too much it's I think I put way too much because I don't think I think I was just supposed to like run it through but I think I did it like I would do my normal my normal hair stuff like my hair gel but it was like a leave-in conditioner and I think I put too much it's kind of nice but it's like weighing down my hair which is so good we need bar stools and we need a couch we might not get either today we're just gonna go look and see we also need a few other like smaller things that IKEA has for cheap so we're just gonna go walk around see what we can get, see what we can find, see what we can do. And then we are going to our old apartment to clean. And I will be showing you all of this as it happens. Yesterday, oh my God, I just got so dizzy. Where to go? Anyway, yesterday when we got this, they did the sweet cream, like sweet cream in the coffee instead of the sweet cream foam. I was like confused, I was like, where's the sweet cream? But honestly, yesterday was kind of better with the sweet cream like in it. That shit kind of was good. I've been drinking coffee again though. If you're wondering, I drank it yesterday for the first time in like a month and a half, which is fucking crazy. Like I missed it. I'm not gonna drink it every day. I'm just gonna drink it like when I want to, like right now. I'm like really hungry. Nice. Bacon Gouda, no bacon. This shit is so good. It hits different. I hope I remember to take these pimple patches off before we hit IKEA because. I mean, they're kind of like cute little accessories to my outfit. Do you say accessories or accessories? Accessories. It was a weird fucking dream last night. It was real weird. You know when you like don't really fully like remember your dream and like what it was about, but you just know it was like fucking weird. That's how I felt last night. It felt weird, but I like don't remember what the fuck happened. Like I have no clue what happened. Oh wait, I remember. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I remember. I just remembered. Let me tell you my fucking dream real quick. I'm telling you too. My sister just. So my sister just got married in real life, and in my dream they were like divorced. And she was getting married to someone else. And the guy was like really freaking old and like weird and like just weird. Her first wedding, she like cared, she, like the wedding in real life was like really, really pretty. And like she put a lot of time in the planning it and like cared about it a lot. But then in my dream, like this wedding, because she already had a wedding and she was like divorced and she was marrying someone else, she like didn't care. And I remember I like was a bridesmaid again. And like I went to, I was like putting on my makeup and we had to like hurry up because it was like time to go. I didn't put on any. I literally just put on foundation so I looked weird. Like, you know when you don't put on any powder or like blush or fucking bronzer or like anything else, just foundation, you look weird. I like looked like that and I like looked into the building and I saw that like there was like a lot of people out there. <clears throat> oh my God, what is wrong with me? And like everyone was out there and me and my sister were the only one not out there and we were bridesmaids. So we were like, oh my God, we have to fucking go. Like she's about to walk down the aisle. And then I like, went out and like she's, she wasn't even out for like another 30 minutes. And I just like, I was trying to like run back and like put my blush and like contour on at least we were all waiting for her to walk down the aisle and just standing there and then everyone just started like walking around and it, and they had us like moving uh, it was just weird it was like literally the biggest mess ever and then like some other weird shit happened after that i don't fully remember that's it that's my story anyway we're heading to ikea can't take a dose junior
We just cleaned. We're not done yet. Did some of it. Can't even say we did hot. I don't even know. We still have this couch here because we're getting rid of it. And we have some stuff here that we're donating. And it's just kind of sad. Like, look at this. God, this was our room for two years. Our closet. This is sad. I'm gonna miss these big windows. This is the one thing that our new apartment doesn't have. Big windows like this. Like this is probably double the size we have now. Our bathroom is empty. I, I bought the wrong cleaner, so I used toilet bowl cleaner in the tub, which is probably the worst idea I've ever had. I don't know why I did that. And it bleached the tub. Like streaks. So I'm gonna have to come back and try to fix that. How you feel? Uh, yeah, try it. So I'm looking rough. So, yesterday, after I think the last thing I filmed was cleaning our old apartment. After that, I went and hung out with Mariana for like the whole night. And then I drove an hour and a half home. I didn't film any of it. But I'm gonna do an Ikea haul. And I also got some things from Five Below. So I'm gonna do a haul real quick. Didn't get that much, but we got a few things. So, first thing I got are these, I'm thinking, little like cork pot things. Like, you know, when you have like a hot pot and you don't want to put it on the, on the countertop, so you put this down and it protects the countertop. And then I got this plant pot. This is only $3.99, I think, which like I feel like isn't that bad for the size. I don't know what plant I'm going to put in there yet. I thought it would fit my ZZ plant, but it might be a little bit too small. I don't know yet, but I got this. And then I got a whisk pack. It literally comes with two. It was like $4. It comes with a mini one and a regular size one if you if you watched my cooking videos i have not had a real whisk i only got a whisk so cooking videos are about to get real lit and then i got the scrubber i i have like one scrubber that i use for like dishes and then i have one scrubber that i use for like cleaning the sink out like scrubbing the sink after i wash the dishes you know so this one's pretty cool too because it it's a suction cup. Love that. And I got a pizza cutter. This was 99 cents. And I remember that because that's why I got it. Because we had a pizza cutter before and it broke. So hopefully this 99 cent one will last longer. Got these two candles. Smell really fucking good. I love that it show, like tells you how long they last. I just noticed that. But this one lasts 25 hours. This one lasts 40. This is apple. And this is pumpkin. So all I know about them because there's apples and pumpkins on the top. And these were like so fucking cheap. This was like a dollar and this was like two dollars. That's really fucking cheap for candles. The last thing I got from Ikea is this fucking doormat. It's just plain, doesn't have anything on it. And it was five dollars, which is fucking cheap. I was thinking about possibly painting something on it, but I think, I'm just gonna leave it blank. I'm gonna actually put this on the back patio porch thing because there's like i like swept the back back porch like really good but there's still like dirt out there a little bit it's like screened in but still i just feel like it'd be better because our our apartment has like carpet out there like at the front door like it's all everything's carpeted you don't really need a doormat I'm probably gonna end up getting one eventually but we didn't find one we liked so i'm probably just gonna put that plain one by the back porch there's more dirt coming in from back there than the fucking front door so i don't know and then went to five below and i got this it's a stool. We have so many shelves on our cabinets and they're kind of high up, so. Folding stool, step stool, it's $5. And then I got a neck pillow, which I can use while I edit. Ow, that hurts. I know, I got a vacuum today and it's literally covered in fucking hair already. Then I got these collapsible bins for, we have like a towel closet, linen closet in our bathroom and there's like an extra shelf and our drawers and our old apartment are like really big in our bathroom and now that in this one they're like really really small we have a lot of extra stuff that like won't fit so i just got these so we can put like that extra stuff in that closet and have it like organized in baskets you know i feel like i got something else at five below but maybe not Dude, my allergies have been so fucking bad because the dust of moving and cleaning our old apartment and everything is just fucking me up. It's fucking me up. Oh, I almost got one of those like letter boards. You know those like letter boards? Top below has them. They only had a pink one and I kind of want like a black or a gray one. But they also had one that lights up and I kind of wish I got that, but I didn't. I, I know what I'm going to write on it already, so I'll show you guys if I ever get that. I got it. But yeah, I think that's it for this vlog. We're still trying to find a cheap couch. We really want just something like so fucking cheap because with dogs like and in a, an apartment, there's no point of spending fucking a thousand dollars on a fucking couch right now. Look at this fucking pimple. I need to put pimple back on it. It's juicy. You ready to go. I don't even know if this vlog was good enough or long enough, but I hope you enjoyed it. I don't know if I'm gonna finish it. But they're fighting me so loud. I don't know if I'm gonna film anything else today because I'm just gonna kind of chill and kind of organize, so. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you want. And then I love you guys. Bye.
I feel like I always have to do this at the end or it's not complete. Thumbs up if you feel the same way. But I'm also still wearing the same outfit that I've been wearing for the past day and a half. <sighs> okay, bye.